Hello everybody and how are you all doing today? It is Rusty Champagne here with you and I hope you are having a wonderful day. We're here with a first look of a game that is listed as coming soon on Steam. This game is very simply called Miami Hotel Simulator. Or as you see on the screen, Miami Hotel Sim. So you can choose what you want the name of the game to be. The description of the game is even more simple on Steam. It is described as a hotel management simulator where you can renovate and maintain your hotel set in Miami. It doesn't get any more simple than that in terms of a description. Uh, the game right now just says that it is coming soon and that the prologue is set to be coming out sometime this month. And that's about all we know. I had a couple people that were talking about this in uh, one of my most recent live streams. And so I figured, yeah, let's let's give it a look and see exactly what this is all about and what we've got going on in this game where we are going to renovate a hotel set in Miami. So save name, obviously, Rusty Champagne, because that's what it always is. And that looks maybe like Miami. I don't know. I have not been along the main strip of Miami to tell you whether or not that's the case. Uh, this is a nice little drone-type shot we got going. I wonder if this is anywhere near my beach club. Uh, I wonder if that's the peeper that, like, peeps on everyone's videos or on all the people in my uh, beach club at the rusty chair. I want to know what this is all about. I'm not quite sure. There seems to be someone who's videotaping a bunch of or doing video recordings of a bunch of fancy cars. And fuchsia houses and or, uh, uh, wait a minute, I know her. She is definitely from Center Station. I recognize that sweatshirt anywhere. She was definitely from Center Station Simulator. Okay, what's going on here? We've we've crossed dimensions. I am a little bit scared now. Okay, uh, that's weird. Okay, um, meanwhile, you've taken a bold step by investing your last dime in purchasing a hotel. That sounds stupid already. Hoping for a substantial return on investment. As a former convict, oh, this is even better. This is your chance to turn your life around and make things right. However, be vigilant to avoid bankruptcy. What do I care? I'm a former convict. This <laughs> represents your final opportunity to set things straight. Let's first start with the bar. Okay, let's start with the bar. So, yeah, WASD. We got some motion blur going on. There's probably a way to turn that off. Let me see uh, settings. Let's get rid of that motion blur. Uh, I thought I, I thought I saw it in here somewhere. Graphics, um, motion blur. Nope, we don't want that. Get rid of that and go back and resume. So yeah, no motion blur anymore. We don't need that kind of stuff in our life. So go into the bar and where's the bar? Enjoy the food. I think it said that this is the Miami Hotel. Let's take a look. Did it say it's the Miami Hotel? It did. And I'm, I'm telling you, if I see that woman again, I'm actually going to take a little walk around here. I can't walk through here because there's a force field. But I want to see because that woman was definitely wearing the cat sweatshirt from Center Station Simulator. And you look. Can I cross the street real quick? I'm going to cross the street real quick. Let's see you. You definitely look a lot like the person from Center Station. They might have put different shoes on you, but you definitely have the same kind of walk. I'm I'm a little bit scared. I feel like I've crossed into a different dimension. Uh, we're going to go into the bar. Okay. Uh, clean the floor at the bar. So clear it or clean it, one or the other. So I guess I'm going to do this maybe with my broom. Uh, yes, we can. So let's do that. So we're going to hit all these dark spots. I don't want to know what these dark spots were. All I know is that we're cleaning them, and that's what matters. So let's do that. Uh, are there any other dark spots? If they are going to manage your vision, press tab to access manager vision and easily identify tasks that require attention. This sounds a lot like Spidey Sense from House Flipper 2, or Flipper Sense, as they call it there. So, again, if they start asking me to build a tube furnace and a water machine and a water access point, I'm just going to slowly walk away from my computer. That's all I can say. So, okay, press tab to get mission help. Okay, so what do you want? Oh, so we're going to pick those up. So I guess I'm just going to use my hand. Why cigar? Grab them. And, oh, put them into the machine. Okay, uh, combine. So we're going to combine the box with the machine. 
Okay, so okay, left click in E. I'm, I'm telling you, this is all very, very familiar. Paint the bar walls. Again, if they ask me to make a tube furnace, I'm just going to run. <laughs> I'm just simply going to run. Need paint. So, uh, where do we get some paint? Okay. Let's, oh, is the paint here? The paint is here. Load old lavender. Fill the roller brush. Okay. So, let's fill, oh, do that. Yeah, this ought to be an interesting color. Okay. So, we just do that. All right. Do we have to do the whole thing, I'm assuming? I'm guessing. We got to go all the way around. So, let's do that. Let's not paint the window. That's probably a bad idea. Oh, we got all right. We're going to have to do this a number of times. I see your game. I get you now. I'm picking up what you're putting down. Okay, let's uh, go over here. And we're going to keep going. So, all right. Because we're going to go all the way around the room with this and get this all painted. Why are these walls thinner than the others? I don't know. Like, you're a, a thick wall, and the others were thin. It's, uh, it's mysteries of drywall. That's all I know. So... <laughs> Gonna keep going again. If I see, there she is, right there, right there. She's got the cat sweatshirt on. She's from Center Station. She's a spy. That's that brush has same paint. I'm telling you, I'm not making this up. You can see her. She's in Center Station Simulator. Something's not right here. It is absolutely not right. I didn't realize that the desert was in Miami. Um, it, okay, I, I'm so thrown right now. Okay, let's, meanwhile, let's just paint the bar walls. <laughs> let's just do that. Everything's going to be fine. Uh, it'll be dark by the time I get it done, but that's okay. Man, this is a lot of painting. Uh, they should have made this part a little bit faster, I'm thinking. But it's okay. It's fine. Um, again, if only painting in real life was this easy. But alas, it is not. And if only the roller held more than two and a half <laughs> walls of, of paint. But you can't have everything. So, no biggie. Let's do one more over here. And is that going to be it? Do we need more? I guess we need it on these. Yeah, we probably need it on these sections. So, let's do this section here. There it is. And how about this section here? There it is. Is that all? Uh, let's do Spidey Sense again. Oh, nope. But now what? So, what are we doing now? Uh, what do you want me to do? Go to room 106. Okay, so let's get rid of that. So room 106, I'm assuming that's on the first floor. Is it? Let's open the door. E? Uh, no. So apparently 106 is on a floor above here. So let's go upstairs. So maybe that's the basement? I don't know. 105, 106. This is a very scary looking lobby. Very, very scary. I don't want to know what happened here. Let's open this up. And this room looks even worse. So this is a dirty room with a value of 10 bucks. If we could get $10 for this, I would just leave it like this. But I don't think we can. So let's clean this all up. This is house flipper all over again. All right. We're going to get all that. Oh, we can, we're getting money for that, it seems like. So, yeah, all that. What's the matter with this? I mean, what? This couch like this isn't isn't worth anything? I mean, it looks so good. Uh, it's going to take a little bit longer to get rid of, so... All right. Uh, garbage. So, Oh, no, that's a door. We can't get rid of that. Uh, really old-fashioned coat rack. And got more stuff over here. Are there lights in here by any chance? It does not appear. Although there's that, like, neon bar all the way around the room. Okay. And what else? Uh, we can't save the janky bed, so that's going to have to go away. It's going to take a little longer, but it's gone. And... Uh, what are you? And why were you under the bed? I don't want to know. So that's gone. And some more garbage. So now I guess we have to clean up the floor. So let's do that. So let's grab our mop, clean up the floor, and do this. So yeah, if you like hotel flip, if you like house flipper, this game's probably going to be a little bit up your alley, possibly because you're doing the same kind of thing but in a much more simplistic manner. So, we're going to clean up all the stains off the wall, but instead of having the magic brush, we have the magic super swiffer, maybe, kind of, and we got another stain over here. Is there anything else? So, now what do we want? Oh, we got to go in here. Okay. So, oh man, crimes against humanity have happened in here, and again, I don't see any lights in here, 
so I can't even hit a switch. Oh, my. Oh, dear goodness. Uh, let's just pick all this up. I'm guessing this all just gets thrown away. Yes, it does. So wh what did you guys do to this toilet? And why are there three of them in here? Why does this room have three toilets? I don't want to know. Okay, and a bucket. Because you need three... You need a toilet for... You need a bucket for three toilets. So... <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's clean up these and clean up that. Man, the, and even these walls are janky. This is such a weird bathroom. Such a weird bathroom. Okay, now what? So let's take a look. Go to the lobby and use the laptop. Okay, so back downstairs we go. Let me put away my, uh, my Swiffer and go to the lobby. Use the laptop. This laptop looks like one of my old ones from about 2017. Uh, it's probably got the amount of power that I can run a spreadsheet on uh use a computer and wow time goes fast press any key to begin okay press uh purchase a bed and a toilet so i'm guessing i'm going to do that at the market and we're going to go with a modern bed and a toilet okay there we go gonna get those toilet has been added to the cart so we're gonna go up here to the carts put it in the cart and complete the order okay purchase premium delivery or wait a couple hours so how much is premium delivery a hundred dollars okay uh i'm impatient let's do that so there it is wait for items to be delivered well i paid for premium delivery so they better darn toot and be out there uh let's escape uh you just made your first purchases from the market your order will be delivered in a couple hours of in-game hours keep track of the delivery progress with the market app on your laptop remember you can expedite expedite the delivery time by opting for premium service at an additional cost okay so go to the back of the hotel okay this could be scary uh where's the back that's the front and so i'm guessing i'm going to go through these doors and yes this looks a lot like the back so where is my delivery truck i'm at the back of the hotel oh is it just out here oh it's just these boxes I was looking for a truck. Apparently, they can shrink the toilet and the bed into these small boxes. So, <laughs> good to know. Let's run upstairs. Whoop, let's go up the stairs. That's important. Into 106. Going to go into here. Going to release the toilet. <laughs> release the hounds. Oh, pick it up. And hold it down to release it. Release it. Okay, let's try that again. All right, and then right click. Oh, okay. So you got to like hold down mouse, both mouse buttons to do this. And how, okay. Oh, so, uh, and then Q and E to rotate it. So the toilet, I guess, can go. Oh, no, it's just, uh, it, okay. I think this is really kind of weird. I don't know why they have you release it. So, okay. Um, so, okay. So, really, all right, so plate. Oh, you just right-click the place. So I don't have to do the... I, I, the release was throwing me off. Yeah, I'm very easily thrown off. So, oh, and snap rotate. So Q and E. Okay, so that's like snap. Okay, and then place. Oh, darn it. So you got to... Okay, so then left-click. All right, it's a little weird. The controls are a little weird because I was holding down right-click all the time and then hit left click to do it. Uh, so I had both clicks going on. And let's go to the bed. So let's get the bed. And where's the back again? I'm already getting lost in my own hotel. And here it is, one little box. The bed is going to magically appear and magically be much bigger than this. So let's go and we're going to set it along this wall. So again, we're going to place and I'm just going to leave this like this and I'm going to left click while holding down the right click and there it is perfect i've completed my first room now i can welcome guests remember enhancing your rooms leads to greater income after each guest tidy up the space and elevate its worth by adding valuable items and better furniture a well-kept room equals higher income okay so we've got one room and we can now open up the hotel for customers from our computer so let's do that so we're going to go here and I guess I'm going to go to my hotel. And the hotel is now... Okay. Um, the uh, Rusty 
I can't think of anything fancy right now, so I'm just going to go with the Rusty Champagne Hotel. Uh, we're just going to do that. <laughs> I can't think of anything better than that right now. So, oh, wow, this room is now worth $100, and all the others are worth 10 So there we go. The Rusty Champagne Hotel. Uh, oh, words. The Rusty Champagne Hotel is open for your convenience. Wait for a customer to arrive. I've got nothing better to do. Let us see. Enjoy the food. We don't have any, but enjoy it anyway. So now I'm going to stand out here by the door, and we're going to wait for a customer to arrive. Again, there's the lady with the cat sweatshirt. I know her. I definitely know her. So I'm guessing that's all the same models, maybe from Unity. I have no idea. Uh, where's my customer that's going to be arriving? This is exactly like Supermarket Simulator, where you got to wait for a long time for people to show up. Save the game. There we go. Rusty Champagne has been saved. All right, where's my customer? Is it going to be you in the purple vehicle, or are you just going to drive on by? You're going to drive on by. Yeah, these, these character models are very, very similar. Extremely similar. And again, I, I'm assuming someone's going to eventually show up. So I'm just going to stay here. I see we got keys there. Meanwhile, I could have completely gotten another room done. While I'm waiting, this looks like the guy. Yep, and he's got the bald head. He is definitely from Center Station. Most definitely. They changed your face, but you're absolutely from Center Station Simulator. Absolutely. I've gone into a time warp uh, where we've, we've opened a portal to another dimension. We have. Uh, where's the key for 106? Which one is well, 104, 105, 107? Uh, 106. There we go. Grab it and give it to you there you go and have a good time oh wow everybody's coming in uh what do you want uh we're gonna have to refuse you guys because we don't have a room uh, again all these character models are straight from center station they are all center station you've got the sleeves on your arms oh my goodness this is seriously a portal to another dimension i am freaked out i am absolutely freaked out all right, let's go to 101. And hey, where's 101? Oh, where the heck is 101? Okay. And let's open it. And let's clean it. Clean the dirt and the garbages. So all the dirt and all the garbage is going to be clean. And all outs. So I guess all these people are just going to have to wait while I get this room cleaned up and get more stuff in here. That's all I can figure. Again, what is this thing and why is it under the bed? Uh, so many questions, so few answers. Uh, I just don't know. And we've got this. So this bed is horrid. Uh, some kind of <laughs> whopper box in there. So let's clean up all the dirt with our Super Swiffer. Again, I guess those people are just going to wait downstairs. I mean, they can't ransack the place because there's nothing in here to ransack. So <laughs> at least I've got that going for me. Nothing bad can come of this because there's nothing down there to steal. So we're, we're good there. We just opened up the joint. And I'm assuming they will eventually leave. And I'm assuming that nothing's going to happen bad because time is marching on in this game. And uh, we're going to go in here, open this door. Again, more crimes against humanity in here. So we're going to get our hands and get rid of all this. At least we get money for the garbage, so there's that. Again, those toilets. What on earth happened to these toilets? I just don't know. Room needs a bed and a toilet. Yes, it does. That's generally how they work, is that they generally need a bed and a toilet. So, oh, hi, sir. How you doing? Are you coming downstairs? Again, all these people. Why is it that this place is just now open and I got all these people here? That makes no sense. Uh, again, I, I can't question it. I just can't question it. Modern bed and a uh, toilet so toilet there we go get all that let's complete that order and get that done and now i guess that guy left did he i don't know where did he go i don't i don't really have a room for you i don't have rooms for any of you so i don't know what you want oh there you are uh, so are you going back oh you're going back upstairs and I really can't afford to keep expediting delivery on these things. I really can't because that's just going to eat into my money. So meanwhile, I guess I can, oh, but I don't want to screw up the tutorial. Go to room 101. 
Okay, uh, what happens if I go back to room 101 again? I'm just going to follow the tutorial. I'm going to see what they want. So, yeah, room needs a bed and a toilet. I'm ordering it. I understand that. So, let's... Yeah, I know it needs a bed and a toilet. I ordered them! So, ugh! Again, all you guys... Uh, I, the, the, we're, we're having a soft open. I've got nothing for you. Yep, you've got that tracksuit on. Amazing. Absolutely amazing. Unbelievable. Absolutely unbelievable. Okay, let's go in here. And let's go back to our market. And let's see. I should just order a bunch of toilets and beds all at the same time. I really should have done that. And uh, okay, not much longer to wait. So we're, I'm, I'm assuming I'm going to have to do that a couple more times, but I need to have the money for it. So this premium service will deliver your goods in a half an hour. It's not worth the hundred dollars, at least not right now. I just don't have that much money. So, oh man, this is like painstakingly slow. So next time I order stuff, I might order two at a time. Had I known it was going to be that kind of an issue, I would have done it. It is 22.30 a.m. That might be a conundrum in the space-time continuum. I could be wrong, but I don't know if that's the way time works. I Again, I could be wrong. It might just be me. You're walking around with your key, so I, I guess you're fine. I'm going to go back here. I'm going to get another modern bed, and we're going to take that upstairs. Okay, you're now waiting, so let me drop this down. So let me release this. Because you now seem like you're waiting and like you're done. Okay, there's the key. Perfect. All right, let's set that there. So, oh, no, don't drop it. Put it up. All right, that works. So let's go to room 101 first. Let's put this in place first. Let's do this. I'm following the tutorial. I'm not diverting from the tutorial. I'm staying on target with the tutorial. It needs a bed and a toilet. I know. I have them now. So place and shift and snap to rotate and we're going to put it right about there between the windows because that feels like a good oh no uh, ro uh snap to rotate and maybe i got to step it out a little bit yes i do and there so there we go now you need a toilet let's get you a toilet i don't know why anyone would want to walk through this hallway but they want me to just do room 101 right now so i i've got to do these things in order there's an order to operations it's all about the order of operations. We cannot deviate from such. Absolutely cannot deviate from such. So we're going to follow the order of operations regardless. Because if they wanted us to clean the hallway, they would have told us to clean the hallway. But they told us we needed a, a toilet. So we're getting a toilet. So we're going to do that. So we're going to place that. And we're going to put it right back there. And drop it down. Did I put it backwards? I put it backwards. So grab it. Turn it around. What a maroon. And... Spin it. Uh, uh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Grab it. And spin it. Okay. And place it. That's better. Okay. Go to room 102. So, all right. So, we got to clean all the rooms. So, that's what we're going to do. We're just going to clean all the rooms up. And we're just going to keep doing this. And apparently, all the people downstairs are just going to have to wait. Is there a way to close the hotel? I'm thinking there is, so let's let's go back down here. Because, again, all you guys are waiting, and I've got nothing for you. So I don't know. I mean, maybe, let's see. If you buy a uh, if you buy some soda, am I getting money for this? I'm going to look at this right now. Let's see. Am I getting money for this? I don't know. Uh, what were you saying? I didn't see what you were saying. So what did you say something? I If you did, I didn't see it. So, uh, yeah, I, I don't know what to do about all you guys. So I'm just I'm going to close the place up because this seems weird that you're all standing out here while I am still cleaning the place. So all of you, um, uh, thank you for stopping by. We're not ready for you. Nothing left on the vending machine. Yes, I, I understand that. Uh, we're not that far yet. So let's let's close this place again. I you, you, you shouldn't be here. We're not ready for you people. We're just not ready. Okay. Um, all of you, head on out. Uh, thank you for coming by. Hey, have a nice day. <sighs> so weird. <laughs> okay. Let's go to room 102. And let's see what we can do for you in here. Uh, more of the stuff. More dirt. More garbages. So let's get all this taken care of. 
And all of this, this room seems like extra janky. So we're going to do this. It's got an interesting hue in here, probably because of the time. At least you didn't have the weird thing under the bed, so there's that. Uh, what is that glowing down there? I don't know. It's it's very strange. So, But you've got the, the same menagerie of garbage that we've come to expect from the other rooms. So there's that. Uh, but And, of course, an empty pizza box. There's the, the, the pot or whatever it is that appears in every room. Um, at least it's consistent. Let's go in here. And this one has a bathtub. And there's the really horrid toilet. And now we just got to get our, our Swiffer and Swift the place like mad. So let's do that. Oh, got to hold it down. Got to make sure to hold it down until the circle fills. Again, what is that in the floor? I don't know. Um, it's, it's weird. It's shiny. <laughs> Again, so many questions, so few answers. It looks so nice outside, but this hotel... No, we don't even have a backstory for this hotel other than the fact that we're a convict and we're trying to not go bankrupt even though we're a convict. I don't know where we got the money to to get this. I don't know if we had it before we went to jail. Maybe we did. I don't have any idea. All right, room needs a bed and a toilet. So I'm going to order a couple of beds and a couple of toilets because we're going to need it. So I got 708. So can I order three? I can order three. So I'm going to order three beds and three toilets. We're going to just do that right, right from the... Right from the jump. Uh, I don't need that. So throw, put that away and use the computer. Let's go in here. Mark it. And we're going to get three modern beds and three toilets. And that's going to give me... I've got enough money for that. Yeah, I know I've got enough money for that. Yeah, 630. Complete the order. So let's do that. Maybe I've made a giant mistake, but I don't think so. So we'll find out. Because right now, it seems like they just want me to go to each of the rooms. So what are the odds that they're going to want me to go to room 103 after that? I, I'm, I'm so tempted to keep going, but I don't want to mess up with the tutorial. I'm just going to I'm going to stick with it. I think it's going to go in order, but you just never know with these tutorials. And I'm just going to take it nice and easy and wait for my furniture to arrive. Which should be momentarily. It just takes two in-game hours which feels like forever when you're standing at a screen watching a little bar go across. So let's take a look. The hotel is currently closed because we got like nothing in here. Uh, what can I do with this bucket of paint? Can I like put it somewhere? Again, why did you not tell me to put all the stuff in here? I'm going to be really, really, it's going to be really something if they tell me that at some point that this is supposed to go in here or if they don't tell me that at all we're, we're, we're just like I said we're just going to go through the tutorial and we're going to see what happens what are you uh, $10 of money okay so that's what was shining uh, what are you your plates what's in here uh, looks like a the beginnings of a kitchen okay and yeah, so this is like a dining area with a few janky tables that are kind of all over the place and would be messing with OCD. So let's grab this and let's spin it. Uh, yeah, snap, rotate, and let's do that. Because this is not, yeah, that's not going to do with them being on these weird angles. I can't have it. So uh, we're going to take you and we're going to spin you the other direction. So you're going to be this way right underneath that window are you underneath that window you are now and how close are you to it right about there and how about you let's also put you underneath the window everybody gets a window seat here in the rusty shampoo paint hotel so everybody under the window perfect need a couple more but we're not going to worry about that right now is my furniture here yet it should be let's take a look how are we doing it is here. The little indicator went away. So let's grab our furniture. Let's see. Uh, is there an indicator? You're a modern bed. That's good. So let's grab modern bed. And off to room 102 we go. Because that was where we left off was 102. So let's do that. It is, uh, where is 102? It is over here. So in we go. And we're going to take that bed. And we're going to set it uh, along this wall right about here so we're going to place it holding down right click 
and then we're going to, while holding down the right mouse button, we're going to click the left mouse button. The bed is clean. And now we need, uh, uh, yeah, we need a toilet, which is downstairs. So all the running, and nope, this is the back. So we're going to go back here, and we're going to get a toilet. Are you a toilet? You are. Run back upstairs. And we're going to see if the next thing we have to do is go to room 103. It would not surprise me, and that would lead me to believe that this, this is the case. I'm going to need to have rooms open, uh, which is fine. If, that is, if that's the truth, at least I'll know, and we'll, we'll go from there. So if I was going to put a toilet somewhere, where would I put it? I feel like I would want to put it uh, somewhere away. I, I, well, the old one was there, which is weird. So I'm going to set this one over here in this corner. Because it feels like it's a better place to put it. Oh, uh, got to release it. There we go. Room 103. So we're going to do the same thing here. Room 103 is going to be the same thing. Let's open this up. Now, if the demo ends with me just cleaning up the rooms, I'm going to be a little bit perturbed. Just a little bit. But we're going to see. Uh, I've got a feeling I'm going to have to open these rooms up at some point. Man, what the heck got eaten in here? This is like way too many um, Chinese food containers. It's just, what the, oh man. This, now I can understand why we got this place on such a steal because it's really, really a thing. Wow, lots of noodles were in there. And uh, that, that was knocked over. That wasn't even standing upright like in the other places. Dirt and garbages, let's open you up. More crimes against humanity. And, oh, so the pot in this room is in here. And, yeah, it's so strange. Okay, uh, Swiffer. Get the Swiffer going. It is absolutely hilarious to me that all the character models in this game are basically reskins of Center Station Simulator. I, I don't even know what to say. I just do not even know what to say. It blows my mind um, that they could basically... They gave them different faces, but the outfits are, like, almost identical. It's, it is hilarity at its finest. Uh, bed in the toilet. Yep, I kind of figured that. So let us go back to our hand tool. And we got another bed and another toilet downstairs because we were smart this time and ordered three of them simultaneously, like. So, uh, oh, no, that's toilet this time. So let's go here, run upstairs with toilets into room 103 and we're going to set up a toilet right in here and wow this is a small bathroom man they don't even have a window in here that kind of stinks for them okay and we're going to set that oh uh, where am i going to put it I'm going to snap it and put it right here because i'm going to eventually they're going to need like bathtubs and showers in this place so this one's just going to go here and that works and then we need a bed Hotel is currently closed because it's really a nightmare up here. It's absolutely a nightmare. Okay. So, modern bed. So, again, the reason I'm following a tutorial, I'm, I'm doing this on purpose. Because if nothing else, it, it illustrates the fact that there are things that they, they don't mention potentially in the tutorial that maybe they should mention. Like, yeah, clean up the floor in the hallway and things like that. So may, maybe that's, uh, I mean, it should be implied, but they don't mention it. So I, I'm kind of doing this maybe just to potentially prove a point. Uh, I don't know. So room 104. So we're going to do the same thing. 104. We're going to open this up. So how many rooms do I have left at? 105 and 106. Uh, or, did, oh, no, I did 106. So I got 105 and 107 are the only ones I've got left after this. So more dirt, more garbages to be cleaned up. So let's do all this, get all this done. And I'm assuming that after that, I'm only gonna have those two rooms that are left. And then we can, I, like I said, I'm guessing that if they want me to go to those rooms, I'm going to probably have to reopen the joint and have to give out a bunch of rooms in order to do this. And that's fine, I will do that. So we're going to get rid of all this. So much dirt, so many garbages, uh, so many uh, food containers uh, that apparently they didn't put garbage cans in these rooms. So this is why we're dealing with this. Okay, uh, how about in here? 
Yeah, open this. And we got that. And then we got that. So all the Swiffering now. Let's get our Swiffer on. And we've got this. And this. And this. And that. And this. It all looks the same. It's a weird shade of gray. I don't know. I guess that's what gar that's what dirt is. It's all a weird shade of gray that just appears on the walls and such. I do it new. Uh, bed in a toilet. Yes, it does. Amazingly enough. So, oh, I'm, I'm doing stuff in the hallway. I hope this doesn't wreck anything. Hey, it's not getting me money either, so that's that. Okay, so hands and a bed. So let's get the bed and take it upstairs. And 104 is where we are now. So bed. And we're going to put the bed right... Oh, this is a nice room. So we're going to put the bed over here in this corner. So place. Uh, shift Q, Shift Q, Shift Q, Shift Q to spin it. And get it right about there. And then we need our toilets. I wish I had my ball of holding that I could put all this stuff in. Or my teleporter gun to put all this stuff in. But no, we do not. Okay. So let's run upstairs. 104. And we need a toilet. So apparently the room is $50 without a toilet and $100 if you do put in a toilet. That's kind of funny. So we're going to put the toilet over here this time. So we're going to place it right there in that corner. Uh, there. Okay. 105. So now I'm going to have to open the place up because I don't have enough money. So I'm going to clean up the hallway because that's going to give me enough money once I get rid of all this. So we're going to clean all this up, get all this money for all this garbage, because I need $200. I need $210 for another, a, uh, another set of beds and toilets. So we're going to just get rid of all this. All the TVs, that's lots of money. So, yeah, watch. This is going to break something. I, I'm almost tempted to like leave one piece of garbage out here just to make sure nothing bad happens. But aside from that, get rid of everything else. So maybe I'll just leave this janky bed up on the wall and have everyone really be confused. Like, what? Why is there a bed there? And everything else in here looks kind of clean. You'll, you'll never know. We'll, we'll never be able to explain it to you. Okay. There's that. Or maybe I can sell everything and just leave the, leave the dirt. Maybe I'll do that. Uh, we got other stuff here we can get rid of. So yeah, let's get rid of all the, get rid of all the garbage. Because I need $420 for two more sets of beds and toilets. And again, all these food containers. What happened in here? It's, it's, and why are there four, uh, four chairs around the window? Were they having a meeting of some sort? Is someone staging an intervention? I, I don't know. Okay, uh, garbage. And, okay, let's go to 105, 106. And let's get rid of all the dirt and garbages. So, dirt and garbages, and again, hopefully this will give us enough money. I don't think it will. I need another $125. I do not see $125 worth of stuff in here. It's not going to be enough. So, I might get up to $300, but I'm not going to get up to $420. So, I'm going to have to probably go and open up the place and get someone in another room is all I can figure. Even though the tutorial did not mention that, but I guess that's what they are going to do in this one because yeah we're not going to have enough money to get the other two rooms decorated with bed and toilet so Swiffer on the wall here and on the floor here and on the floor here and then on the wall here a little bit of stiff wind now blowing that tree around and then we're going to go over here and over here and get this over here and all the brown dirt that is sticking to the walls and there is that all the dirt and garbages no we got some dirt in here too so on these walls and a bed and a toilet okay so now i don't have enough money so i guess at this point i do need to open the place back up because i don't have enough money and we're going to do that so let's open the place back up and see who's going to show oh i didn't clean room 106 let's go clean room 106 so let's do that. Uh, 106. What is going on in here? Uh, garbage. Clean. 
and 95. We got to make the bed. Oh, I don't want to make it. I just want to clean it. So, oh, E to clean. There it is. And do I want to know what happened in here? Uh, let's. Oh, it's clean. Okay. So why is the room dirty? Uh, what is dirty about the room? Uh, what's the matter? Is it something out here? No. Uh, what are you pointing at in here? Uh, that's 105. Okay, so what's what's still dirty in here? We cleaned the bed. Uh, oh, no, it's 100. Um, it was 95 just a second ago. I know it was. I saw that. Okay, let's open the place up. Let's see what's going to happen here. So, customers. Oh, that's just what they said. So, depart... Does that, did that say departure? <laughs> it does. He didn't depart. He departured. Okay. The hotel is open. And we have two more rooms that are dirty. 105 and 107. So we need two more sets of toilets and two more sets of beds. And hopefully with a few more customers, we will have that. So let's wait for the customers to roll in. And we can get, while we're waiting for that, we can get one set of beds and one set of toilets. So let's do that. So let's go to market and let's go to modern bed and toilet. Get that ordered. Complete that order. Now I'm regretting having spent that money on the, uh, on the rush delivery. Because I could have had the extra set had I not spent the money on the premium delivery. But that's on me. They told me I could do it. And that's what I did. They told me I could click on the shiny button. I clicked on the shiny button. It's good to see that we have a fire extinguisher down here. Whether or not it works is a different story, but we have one. So let's take a look outside. What does it look like out here? Um, Kind of sunny on a cloudy day, kind of maybe? A little bit. Where is the sun? It seems like it should be shining over here. I shouldn't be standing in the street. That's probably not a good idea. What street is this anyway? Oh, this is Ocean Boulevard. Okay, do not enter. That's fine. We will not enter. And now we should have customers showing up. Yep, we do. So how you doing? Good to see you. Um, you will get room. What have I done? 101. Oh, yeah. It tells us if the rooms are clean or not. So there you go. And yeah, so you're on your way. And how about you? You are going to go to... Yeah, I know we want room 105, but I need to give... I need money. So, 102. And how about you? You are going to get 103. There you are. Thank you. And for you, you get 104. So, all the money to be made here. Uh, is that one clean? It is. 104. Uh, we are not going to give anyone 105 or 107 because those are not good. So, missing furniture. This room is clean. 107 is just a nightmare. There you are in your cat sweatshirt. That is you. And the rest of you, I'm sorry, I have to refuse. I don't have any. I don't have any rooms. Yeah, I know. What do you want me to tell you? There are no rooms here. It's uh, I, I don't have anything for you. So off you go. I've got to wait until we have more rooms. And then I can get you in here. I can't get you in here either. Why do people keep showing up? Why do more people show up than we have rooms for? I don't know. That person's happy. He didn't pay us for anything. That's even the guy with the beats. Ah, <laughs> oh, man. This is, this is so good. Let us... Okay, there's our... Okay, here's our toilet. So we're going to run this up to room 105. So then I think the only room I've got left to do is 107. So, and they don't close their doors. That's so interesting. Okay. And so we're going to go to 105. And this is the toilet, not the bed. So this toilet's going to go right in here. And we're going to place it and drop it right there. Drop it like it's hot. And there it is. Shake it like a Polaroid picture. And just the bed. Just the bed. Let's grab the bed. And then we just got one more room that we got to do. So up to room 105, right over here. Yep. And we're going to put the bed right here in this little alcove, this little nook. And there it is. 107. I think 107 is clean. I think I cleaned it. 
So I'm almost positive I cleaned 107. It's right here. Did I clean it? Oh, no, I didn't. I didn't clean this one. Okay, let's clean this one. All right, this might give me all the money I need. Maybe. Possibly. No, we're still going to be short. We're not going to have enough. Um, we're going to have to wait for the people to start checking out. And then we might have... I can't. Man, oh, man. I don't know. I don't want to know who was living in here while this place was abandoned. Because I'm, I'm definitely convinced that it was... And how does this happen on Ocean Boulevard, Miami? You, you, you tell me that. <laughs> I want to know. Inquiry minds want to know how this could have possibly happened. How could this have come to such a pass? Why is there a chair and a coat rack in here, but no toilet? Was the toilet to this room in 106? Is that what happened? I, I don't want to know. Okay, uh, more dirt. No dirt in here. All the dirt is out here. So clean the dirt and the garbages. And more dirt, and more dirt, and more dirt, and is there any more dirt? There is some more dirt there. How about here? Yes, we got some dirt here, and we got some dirt in the corner. I don't think a bed's going to fit in there. <laughs> You're not going to get out of it if you get in it. Uh, where? Oh, there's the dirt. I'm like, what other dirt is there here? A bed and a toilet. Yes, I know. Everybody needs a bed. Everybody needs a toilet. Everybody hurts sometimes. Let's run back downstairs. Is there anyone down here yet? No. So I guess at this point now we just wait. All these people are buying stuff, but I unless it gets charged to their room, I wonder if it gets charged to their room because my money is not going up while they are doing this. So I'm hoping all this gets charged to their room. Let's take a look. If we go to customers, what is it saying? Uh, going to pay 100 so, yeah, I'm not seeing anything about them giving us money for for the things that they're getting out of the vending machine. That's not good. Okay, how are you doing? Uh, the room is dirty. Uh, what did you do to it? So, and how do we get you to go on there? Do you, do you just magically fit on there? Is that what it is? Oh, you got to combine it again, E. All the combinations that have to happen. So now I've got enough money. So let's do that. But again, people seem like they're getting stuff out of the vending machine and I'm not getting any money for it. So I want to know why. Markets. And once again, modern bed, modern toilet, modern love. Um, walks on by. Gets me to the church on time. And there we go. Oh, we can ring it. Okay, that's good. Um, it's me. <laughs> Hi, how can I help me? Uh, I'm waiting for someone else to show up here. So now we just got to wait for one more bed, one more toilet. What is this? Just garbage. Okay, that's all that is. That's what I wanted to check. Is that garbage? That's chicken. Um, I'm going to set that on the floor for now. I'm just going to wait. I'm just going to wait. Going to take it easy. We're going to see. I need to clean up room 102 just in case this gentleman wants to come in here and get it. I will get used to this numbering scheme. There's a toilet out here. Why is there a toilet out here? I don't want to know. Okay, let's uh, clean this up. Nope, don't grab the bed. Just clean it. And we got some dirt over here. So there's that. And we got a bedroom or a bathroom. A deter Oh, man. What did you do to the toilet? Seriously, what did you do to the toilet in here? Oi. Okay. Um, are people getting ready to leave at 6.06 .06 in the morning? It looks like it. You are definitely getting ready to leave. Let us take your key. Thank you very much. And combine that. That's going to go there. And are you getting ready to leave? No. People just kind of wander. So now we've got... Uh, did I get the... Did I order one? Or do I not have enough money? I thought I ordered one. Maybe I don't have enough money. Let, let's check back here again. I'm so confused. Uh, the, the, again, short putt. Let's see. Mark it. Uh, oh, it's on the way. It's almost here. It is just short. So we'll be here in just a moment. So is there anyone else here? No. No one that needs assistance, at least. So there it is. Falls out of the sky. I'm waiting for it to get caught on a fire escape. A la supermarket. And I will be with you momentarily. I've got to get room 107 done because it's on my tutorial list. 
So that's important here. Is this the, this was the toilet. Yes, it's the toilet. It says toilet on it. So where do we want you? Uh, we're going to put you right over here. So we're going to place it, and we're going to do Shift-Q to swing it a couple times. Got a toilet. And then we've got a, a, a 104. I can't. I, it's not time to go to 104 yet. Why am I going to 104? Uh, okay, I'm cleaning up the dirt and the garbage, but I was just working on 107. Why are you rerouting me? It's not time to be rerouted. I have to do one thing at a time. You are making me go in other directions from where I was. I'm not on task anymore. Okay, is this room good? Nope, it's still got dirt. So let's get rid of the dirt. And let's go in here and let's see what they did in here. Uh, clean the toilet, make the bed. Okay, again, you did nasty things to the toilet. Now it's much better. Now we're back to room 107. That's what I was trying to do. Ugh! I'm just trying to get a bed in there. That's all I want, just a bed. It's out here. It's right here. I just got to grab it. Okay. Bed. In my hands. In the room. You guys can wait. You're, you're patient. I know you are. You're, you're patient in center station. You're going to be patient here. I know you will. Don't deny it. Okay. We're going to take the bed and we're going to put it right here in this. I'm going to take this bed and I'm going to put it uh, in this corner. That's what I'm going to do. Or close to this corner. So, uh, yeah. I know it needs a bed in the toilet. I'm trying to get that set up. Let's. I'm assuming I'm going to need nightstands at some point. So we're going to just set it right there. There it is. The food buffet is empty. Well, how about that? That was kind of why I waited. So again, I'm not going to clean this stuff up. I'm just going to leave this. So now I'm going to fill the food buffet because I've got chicken down here. So I'm going to grab that and I'm going to combine it with E. Again, some vending machines are empty. I'm glad I didn't fill that. Maybe it wouldn't have had an issue, but we're going to grab that and E. Grab that and E. Grab that and E. Is that it? That's apparently it. Okay, so that... Uh, oh, you can grab the money out of there. That's what it is. Now I understand. Now I get it. Now I got all the cash. Oh, clean the dinner tables. Okay, what dinner tables are not clean? Are you not clean? You're clean. You're clean. You just walked away, so I can't really take it. So now, okay, grab, and we're going to go to the kitchen with you and drop you in there. And now we are going to wash dishes. Okay, very interesting water animation, but what do you know? So now are you going to give me anything else to do? Or Nope, food buffet is empty again. So it seems like we're kind of left to our own devices at times. Oh, no, you've given a key to one of your inferior rooms to a customer. They're likely to be dissatisfied, ref resulting in them offering less money for the room upon checkout. I, all the rooms are, I didn't give someone a bad room. I'm sure I didn't give someone a bad room, uh, but I'll take your key. Uh, okay, the, the room is now dirty. I, I know that. We're going to get that fixed. Uh, is your room good? Okay, you're good. So you're dirty. So let's do that. And what are you looking for? You're just looking for a room. Do I have any that are clean? That one's clean. There you go. There it is. And there's yours. Okay. And you are dirty. Okay. The food buffet is empty. Let's get food for the food buffet. So let's go here. Market. And food. And let's uh, do, oh, we can do a whole bunch of stuff. I wonder how much I can fit in there. Let's kind of go crazy. Let's get a couple of breakfast and a couple of chicken and a couple of steaks and a couple of sushis. And what did I not order two of? Uh, I did not get two of those. So let's get that and maybe a pack of dishes because now I got a bunch of money. So let's do that. And um, maybe I'll do one more of each. Let's do that getting all kinds of crazy. How much money is that? That's $310. That's fine. We're going to wait for that. It's going to take a couple of in-game hours. While that's happening, I can run upstairs and I can clean some of these rooms. So let's do that. What rooms are dirty? Uh, 105 is clean. 101 is dirty because that's where they're telling me to go. So let's go to 101. I hope there's no one in here. Uh, hello, housekeeping. And let's get you cleaned up. 
and uh, Swifford and get the bed made, which I can't do while I'm holding that. So let's clean that up and go in here and clean this up. Swiffer and clean the toilet and the bed is made. You are good. 103. And let's close the door and close. And 103, same thing. Open the door and make the bed. Put that away. Hit four to put that away. Oh, no, one to get back to your hand. Make the bed. That's it. All right, you're good. So now where are we going? 107, clean. That's good. Uh, 101 might be occupied. Uh, at this point, I don't know what rooms are occupied and what rooms are not. So we're just going to wait for... Okay, 104 is clean. Okay. Uh, 105 is clean. So, and I know a couple of my rooms are occupied, so I'm not going to open the doors until I know which ones are occupied and which ones are not. So let's see, 101 is clean. So have a key to 101. There you go. And 103 is clean. And there you go, have a key to 103. How close are we on our food? Is it almost here? Let's find out. It is 2047 AM. Again, I don't think that's how time works. I'm pretty sure that's not how time works. Uh, but again, who am I to tell them? All right, our food is almost here. Let us go outside, watch it fall out of the sky. It'll probably fall out of the sky before we get there. Yep, it's all over the place. And we're going to have to run these in one at a time, I believe. So sushi times two. We're going to take that, put it over here with E. So, oh, it just all goes left to right. Uh, well, I got to get the food buffet finished up first. So I'm going to do that. And chicken times two. So we're going to do all this first. I know that's not what you want me to do, but that's what we're going to do. So we got chicken times two. And then we've got some steak times two. Oh, this is like they're all times two in there already. So I'm going to have tons of food. Uh, I hope I can put it somewhere. Because I'd hate for people to be eating bad food. Oh, man, I've ordered a ton of food. Uh, can I set it up here? Nope, I'll set it right there for now. Uh, sushi. I've already got sushi. Oh! Uh, let's set that down. Can I set it on there? It looks like I can't. I just want some of my breakfast. There we go. There's my breakfast. And I just threw one way over that direction. That's fine. It's all fine. So let's grab some of this and set it down. And I can get, I'll get some more sushi. Let's do that. Uh, where's my sushi? It's all facing the wrong direction. Are you the sushi? Yes, you are. Let's grab that. And we're going to put that out because the world needs more sushi. Okay. Wow, that's going fast. Okay, let's get another thing. Another one. And not more sushi. Uh, what is that? That's more chicken. Let's grab some more chicken. Set that up. And put that up there. So now we're pretty good on the buffet. So now we get to go to 106. Let's go to 106. This is another one of those. We're going to run like crazy. Do all the stuff. Uh, dirt and garbages. Get you cleaned up. Bed is messy. Bed is clean. Now we're going to go in here. Uh, clean that up. The, the fact that the lights go from uh, like bright to dim is a little bit jarring. Uh, it's really, really weird. Uh, this is clean. What is not clean in here? Uh, oh, uh, dirt right there. Swiffer. All the Swiffering is that it. This room is clean. Perfect. Clean the dinner tables. So apparently it's just going to tell you every little thing that you need to do as you kind of go along. So we're going to go back here, clean the dinner tables, take the money, and take that dirty dish put it in here just put it in the sink and we're going to are you oh all the money here so money money and can we stack these uh wait a uh, stack okay uh stack i saw it uh e and we can stack again can we stack again uh you got to find one pixel but you can you just got to find that pixel and then you can do it so some vending machines are empty. And that probably is just going to be... Oh, wait. I didn't want to grab that. Uh, clean dish. And take that. Oh, uh, oh, we can put that on the table. Okay, clean dish on the table. So combine. There we go. And now we're going to uh, wash the dishes. And Oh, I can just hold this down. That's nice. That's a nice feature. And now we can take all these. Oh, can I take the whole stack? Uh, oh, I yeah, if you hit E multiple times, you can. And then we can set them down. Uh, combine. 
There it is. So some vending machinas are empty. And I got people that want some rooms. Oh, no, you're here to turn your room in. Okay. Thank you very much. Good to see you. Thank you for stopping it. And thank you for staying at the Rusty Champagne Hotel. All right. So we got a few more customers. And, oh, not going to release you. Not going to refuse you. All right. This room is clean. 104. There you go. Good to see you. And how about you, 105? Good to see you. And how about you, 106? Good to see you. Ah, oh, okay. So this is kind of the beginnings of the wonderful world of, does this now say the Rusty Champagne Hotel? It does. There it is. We can walk across the street, take a look. Um, once again, the light changes very, very strangely. But here we are. Here's our man in the beats. Good to see you. Uh, please come back and visit us in Center Station next time you're there. Uh, and this is the beginning of our life in the Rusty Champagne Hotel. It'll be interesting to see what else we can do in this demo. I will definitely keep on uh, following this along to see if there are other things that can be done. And exactly at what point it says, congratulations, you finished everything in the demo. So we will continue to take a look at this and see what else there is to do. But that is going to be all for this one. Thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, I'd appreciate it if you gave it a like. If you really like this video, I'd appreciate it even more if you managed, if you uh, gave the channel, if you considered, words are hard, giving the channel a subscribe. I'm going to stand right here in the middle of the street. Until we meet again, thank you as always for being a part of all my silliness. I'm Rusty Champagne, and we will... See you later.